This is Adam Gorney, Rivals.com National Recruiting Director here with 2023 five-star quarterback Malachi Nelson. We can now say that with the rankings coming out on Monday morning. What does that mean to you? Obviously, you know, it's just the ranking and all those kinds of things, but it's got to be pretty special for you. Oh yeah. I mean, I, I think, I think that's the dream. I mean, you know, you want to, you want to be, you want to, you want to be the top rated quarterback or whatever position you are um, in your class. So, you know, it's, it's a dream come true really is. I and mean, I'm thankful for all the guys at rivals, um, you know, you, you know, you, especially when we have a good relationship. So, I mean, I'm, I'm ecstatic. And I appreciate everything. It's been a crazy year, sophomore year going on really when you're junior year spring should be going on. How has that been for you and, and the team and and keeping that low Sal team together, you know? Yeah, no, I think, I think we kind of, you know, with like the limited season, we're almost looking at it, um, you know, like an extended spring season. I mean, it's a live spring season. We get some, you know, basically get some spring games. Um, You know, we got, you know, our six games or whatever it is, you know, we're halfway through the season right now. We're rolling. We're three and no right now. Um, Yeah. We got that. You know, we got another three, three more games this weekend. Yeah, like I said, we're just, you know, we're using it to practice. I think our, we're really young right now. So we're almost, I mean, you know, practicing for next season. We think it's going to be a big, big year for us. We're barely losing any seniors, um, a couple, a couple key assets. But, you know, we're going to, you know, we're a young team, a lot of just, uh, a lot of sophomores, which, you know, 22 and 23 uh, class that, that, I mean, we have, I think we have a really good solid uh, 22 and 23 class um, that, you know, that are obviously young. So we're going to, yeah, I'm, I'm excited for next year. And uh, yeah, we're going to keep rolling. There's plenty of uh, film out there already on you from your freshman year and from camps and seven on seven. But for people that haven't seen you since you're still so young, kind of describe your game. Definitely a pocket passer, but can get out and, and throw off platform, throw on the run. Very accurate. Has the deep ball. Just kind of describe yourself to those people. Exactly. No, I think you I think you, uh, you did a great, uh, a great. Uh, what's it called? Uh, man. No, I mean, yeah, I like to I like to obviously throw it. Um, I think that's, I'm a throw first cup guy, but once I'm out of the pocket, like you said, I think I, I can, I can somewhat make, make, make things happen. Um, so, I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm elusive. I can, uh, once I, when I get out of the pocket, I'm a little bit slippery, but I think, you know, obviously I want to, I want to stay in the pocket, let it fly. But yeah, I mean, coach Danny, my, uh, my quarterback coach, we work on a lot of off platform stuff. Um, so I think it's, you know, once I'm out of the pocket, I'm, I'm, I'm comfortable, almost as comfortable as I am in the pocket. So I think that's big for a quarterback, you know, being able to be comfortable, you know, inside the pocket, outside the pocket, on the run, um, off platform, you know, so on time, all, all, all of that. So I feel like I'm a, I'm a complete quarterback um, and I like to, you know, obviously I like to throw it, but you know, when it, when it calls for it, you know, I'll, sl- I'll step up and run. Really, a, you know, a lot of schools already involved, pretty much everybody. Um, but one that's been tied to you ever since they offered was Oklahoma. Um, a whole lot of, a lot, lot to like with Lincoln Riley's offense. How have they been recruiting you? It seems like from the people that I talk to, including yourself, they've done a tremendous job just staying involved. And and what stands out so much about playing in that offense potentially? Yeah, I mean, you know, Oklahoma is a, it's a great place. I mean, you know, the fan base, it's 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 crazy. It really is. I mean, obviously Lincoln Riley, um, just his, you know, his resume speaks for itself. I mean, the way he's developed quarterbacks, and I mean, the past three years, you know, Heisman's uh, you know, first overall uh, picks in the NFL draft, whatever it is. I mean, he, he's done, you know, he's taking, taking guys from different schools, you know, um, and just developed them. And I think, you know, obviously when I'm choosing a college, I'm going to choose somewhere where I feel comfortable and where, you know, I have a good relationship with a coach, um, you know, academics is big, but I mean, mainly where I feel like I'm going to be developed, you know, for the next level, because that's obviously that's the, the dream. That's the goal. So, yeah, I mean, I love everything they're doing over there. Um, you know, they, they got another big, big time quarterback in the 21 class in Caleb. And I mean, I'm close with him. So, you know, it's cool, you know, talking with a lot of those guys over there, building a relationship because, I mean, you know, that's, you know, soon, obviously, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to obviously, you know, realize some schools where I, you know, I feel more comfortable with than others. And, uh, and yeah, they're, they're definitely um, doing a great job of recruiting. It looks like June is going to be when everybody's going to get out and take visits and really just kind of uncoil this spring and, and everybody's going to hit a lot of schools. You said Oklahoma is going to be one. USC, uh, you know, getting over there and, and really sitting down with the coaches and getting at least a feel for them and Clemson talk about USC, how they've been recruiting you, the draw to, to possibly play home. And then, and then Clemson is a school you've already visited and obviously a whole lot to like there too. Yeah, no, I mean, SC is, I think, you know, it's, it's, it's a family right there. Um, you know, they're, they're doing a great job in, uh, in Southern California recruiting right now. Locked up another, a lot of, uh, you know, big time recruits in uh, you know, the 21 class and, you know, starting at 22 right now. So, 
they're, they're, they're doing great. I mean, I'm excited to see how they do this season. I mean, obviously, yeah, I'm gonna definitely trying to get down there as soon as possible. I mean, just to sit down with the coaches. I mean, I have a great relationship with, you know, all the coaches. Um, so, yeah, that's that, that's that's a big one for me. I'm um, just, you know, because, I mean, at the, at the, the, you know, the end of the road when I'm, you know, I'm choosing a school, I want to I want to feel comfortable. And I mean, I want to have many of those, you know, those days where I can just, you know, get on campus at some of these schools and just feel comfortable. I mean, my uh, one of my coaches always says you want to you want to see these colleges and you want to, you know, you want to be selfish when you're choosing a school because it's the one time in your life where, you know, you got to, you know, this is, this is going to set you up for life really. So, um, yeah, but I, you know, I want to get down to these, these schools on, you know, days where, you know, obviously, you know, they have the, the recruiting days or whatever it is, but, you know, I want to get down to the days where they, they're not expecting, you know, stuff like that Wednesdays, you know, see how they're really, how they're really practicing the coaches, you know, training the players and stuff like that somewhere. Obviously I feel comfortable. Um, so that's that's big, and then yeah, I mean, I'm always I want to get down to to Clemson as well. Um, I've been like you said, I've been down there one time. Uh, I didn't really get to you know tour the facilities, you know, with COVID and stuff like that. But um, yeah, the great, beautiful, beautiful campus. Um, I'm obviously I'm really close with uh, with DJ, their quarterback there, right now. Um, you know, talking with him and uh, his dad. You know, they they love it out there. You know, his whole family really loves it out there. So it's that's that's another place you know, I want to get out in. And talk with you know the coaches, Coach Dabo, Coach Street are out there, and really good guys. Um, and, you know, all my coaches so that you know are can I can I kind of connected with with DJ and me. Um, you know they they say it's a it's a it's a real family out there. Great, uh, great coaches, and uh, it's a great atmosphere and place to be. So that's somewhere I'm definitely trying to head out to as well. Great, Malachi, I appreciate the time, and and like we said, now we can say five star quarterback in the 2023 <laughs> class, and yes, we appreciate sir. it, man. Thanks for the time yes, today. Sir. For sure.